Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. 4K Upscaler. So I connected my uh, PC that I have. You know the one that I custom uh, designed and custom ordered. Uh, I buy power PC. Connected it to my C10 48 inch OLED TV. Let me tell you, this C10 48 inch OLED, it's probably the best gaming uh, OLED TV period. It's perfect for PC. It's excellent for gaming on a console and a PlayStation 5 coming up and X Series X. And here I am with my HDMI 2.1 Belkin cable connected to this C10 48 inch OLED. I have 120 hertz refresh rate selected. I have resolution set at 4K. I have HDR turned on and I have my color space set to YCBCR444, the highest possible color space. What does that mean? That means that I'm gonna get the best possible smoothest experience with the quality with 4K and HDR. And on top of that, I also have a G-Sync available that's turned on. And, uh, this is X-Plane 11. I have everything set to a maximum settings, 4K, HDR, and uh, we're going to fly around a little bit just to show you. Uh, please keep in mind, guys, uh, what you are seeing on this video, it's really, it's not doing it justice in contrast to what you see in person, okay? So we're going to fly around a little bit. Okay, we're gonna get our brakes out a little bit. We're gonna taxi out and we're gonna go ahead and take off. By the way, I cannot wait for Flight Simulator 2020 next Tuesday. I'm really like counting the days this looks remarkably awesome um, I can even see the dirt on the window like right here they're, they're just like how beautiful it looks if I'm listen let me tell you if I'm impressed with X-Plane 11 on this OLED. Imagine how impressed I'm going to be with the uh, Flight Simulator 2020 when it comes out. I mean, look how beautiful everything looks, man. That's just amazing, dude. Just amazing. Hey, yes, now you understand why I told you to purchase the Belkin Ultra High Speed Cables. There's a pretty good reason why I recommended that you guys purchase uh, those cables now you know why now they're coming in handy ultra high speed Belkin cables that's what they're called ultra high speed no one's gonna call them 2.1 no one's gonna write on the uh, the box 2.1 either you have ultra high speed or high speed high speed it's 2.0 Ultra high speed is 2.1. Just remember that. This looks just amazing. Very impressed. Very impressed with the detail. And maybe I can zoom in a little bit more. Uh, listen, guys, what can I say about this TV? This TV is just. Again, thank you, LG. Uh, I'm, I'm still blown away that this was gifted to me. I, I mean, really. Uh, I was like. So thank you, LG. And um, this has to be the, the best gaming OLED TV, period. It's perfect for PC. It's excellent for video game consoles and the upcoming PlayStation 5 and X Series X and X Series S. Uh, this is it, man. Uh, but for a PC, look no further. Let me tell you. 
uh, once you try this on a PC and uh, and you connect your PC with your ultra high speed uh, HDMI cable and you select uh, YCBCR444 color space once you start experiencing all of these things ugh, and you turn that HDR on and their HGIG on you're just gonna be blown away man just how beautiful this looks maybe we can look outside the cockpit a little bit all right let's look outside Turn down the volume a little bit. Wow. Just simply wow, man. Amazing. This is native 4K. 120 hertz. 60 FPS. HDR turned on. Color space YCBCR 444. Uh, it just looks stunning. And this is X-Plane 11. I'm not even using uh, Flight Simulator 2020. Imagine how unbelievably awesome uh, Flight Simulator 2020 is going to look, man, on this OLED TV. I mean, Jesus Christ. Imagine how awesome the Cyberpunk 2020 is going to look on this OLED TV on my PC. Very impressive. Very impressive. And again, remember, guys, what you are seeing, what you are seeing uh, through YouTube, it's really not doing a justice as to what I'm seeing, you know. And on top of HDR, we got HGIG, which is high dynamic range gaming interest group mode that you can uh, utilize under dynamic tone mapping to give you much better HDR highlights um, and then you got Dolby processing you got Dolby Atmos uh, many different types of Dolby processing audio inside this TV this this gotta be the, the, the best TV I have ever laid my hands on honestly I mean, I, I'm trying to find something not to like. There's really nothing here that I can say, hey, I don't like. So Derek, if you're watching this video, remember, you are getting the value for that $1,300, $1,500. If you can find it maybe this holiday season for $1,300, remember, you are getting the value. Uh, the value on this TV, it's unbelievable. And you're not going to be disappointed. That I can guarantee you. You will not be disappointed. Anyway, let's go inside. Um, inside the uh, cockpit. Just a little bit. Uh, this is amazing, dude. I, I'm just simply, uh, right now, I'm blown away by the detail here. Uh, uh, I can't wait to see uh, what Flight Simulator 2020 is going to do uh, for me next Tuesday. I'm just going to be blown away, man. I know I'm going to be blown away. I already know it. I mean, if I'm blown away right now by x 11. And remember, the G-Sync, it's also helping out. You got a G-Sync. And on top of G-Sync, you also have a FreeSync. So it doesn't matter which graphics cards do you have. Whether you have G-Sync, NVIDIA or whether you have uh, AMD FreeSync 1 or 2, this TV covers it all. It doesn't matter what HDR. This te television covers every HDR. Technicolor, HLG, Dolby Vision, you name it. Uh, remember the value. When I talk about this television, this is what I mean about the value. This is what you are getting. And don't worry about the burning. Listen, I I'm so sick and tired of the burning. I don't want to mention it where is the burn-in I mean here I am two months with this TV yet to see a burn-in I'm so sick and tired of, of people talking about the burn-in 
It's becoming, it's getting old, guys, please. All right, well, there you have it, guys. I hope uh, this video gives you some glimpse on why you need to connect your PC to this television. <laughs> Don't go back to your monitor, uh, seriously. I cannot go back to my monitors. Once I experience this detail, this clarity, uh, yeah. It's going to be difficult to go back to, uh, to a monitor, man. It's just going to be impossible. Well, there you have it. There you have it, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked this video. And uh, I'm going to see you guys. Uh, I'll see you soon. Take care.